My name is Romney Williams. I am the CEO of Enso Rings. We're based in uh, Lehigh, Utah, just south of University of Utah. Uh, company is a mission-driven company. We give back um, through various organizations and we're a digitally native uh, silicone ring brand. So in the world of wedding engagement, jewelry and fashion accessories, we have built the, the premium brand um, that was done through some really interesting product innovation. Uh, typical silicone ring looks like rubber, uh, matte finish. We have uh, precious metal or mineral infused rings. This is infused with black pearl. Here is a rose gold ring and a diamond infused ring. Very, very soft but infused with precious minerals and gems that make it much more high-end. Uh, we've been in business for about five and a half years. The founders went on Shark Tank, uh, did a deal on air with Robert Herjavec. It's been a great run. And in a five and a half year period, about five years, we have sold about 3.7 million silicone rings in 110 countries, mostly direct to consumer. The, the program came highly recommended by a professor at the time who was involved in the entrepreneurship program, um, who was aware of Enso's growth and also know he had awareness that when we, we were experiencing tremendous growth and, uh, and market penetration, but still had a lot of answers. We were writing the playbook in the emerging category. And uh, so we had a lot of blind spots. Didn't, we didn't know we didn't know. Back in 2017, what we were grappling with was understanding if our pricing strategy uh, in retail was correct. Are we leaving money on the table? Uh, you know, should we charge more? Should we charge less? It was that intersection of maximizing company profitability while maintaining our premium brand in the category. So it was difficult. Again, very few brands were embarking on the same journey we were in this category. So it was, and we felt like we were premium. So it's hard to just compare and be apples to apples. So they helped us drill down on that, which was great. In 2020, uh, a different group of students did a phenomenal job helping us understand in this growing emerging category of silicone rings, what's the overall awareness in the United States, just general uh, knowledge about the category. And then what was market penetration, uh, who, who had bought silicone rings, of those who had not, who would buy, and then ideas on how to position to those, uh, to those consumers. I'll be honest, uh, my team and I were blown away about this, the caliber of the students, their, their confidence, their demeanor. It was clear that it was very well rehearsed, which is pretty unique. They didn't just wing it. Uh, they each had different parts of the presentation. And it was, uh, they even went so far as to, while presenting different data points and findings, graphs and charts, um, they also had, uh, as supplemental reference, they had a, like a workbook, a binder of other findings, and they would reference different pages we could, where we want to go deeper after, which we did as a team. So that was, that was great. And then, you know, most importantly, the findings and conclusions and recommendations, they were insightful, they were meaningful, and, and they were actionable. So we actually gleaned some valuable takeaways.